Um, we should be live finally. Oh. You know, welcome. Hello. Welcome to the stream. Please. I hope people can see us or people are there or something. Yeah. Who knows? Effect. You know, who knows? I don't know. Check. We can see. Let's let us check. I'm going to check. Check for <clears> us. <throat> I said, fuck it, let's do it live. It's taking a while to come up. Oh, yep. We're, Can we're you hear us? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Audio and visuals are immaculate. That's yeah, what I like to hear. There, yeah. Turn it up. <laughs> Yes! Turn it off. Yes! Now that Barney's barking. Woof. Woof. Welcome, M Jack. M Jack 90 95. Welcome to this Thursday stream. Ooh, look. Oh, what is this? I don't know. We've not been here. World 4 Act 2? Is this like a, some kind of a load screen? It looks like some kind of a load screen. Act pair. All right, all right, all right, all right. You have to choose. Didn't we already do Act 2? I don't, I don't think so. All right, let's do it. Ooh, spooky. It's a spooky. Oh, yeah. So I redid a bunch of stuff on the stream to try to get it back to normal. And I think I have it back to normal. Like, I think people can join the Discord calls and talk to us now. Um, yeah, do it. Join up. Join up. Just join to, to talk. I believe that the phones. Voice. Whoa. Oh. The phones are now working. Oh, oh. Some of these, like, this type of feature in a Sonic game, I'm like, it's cool, but I'm not doing anything. No, it was kind of just going. Ooh, Sonic Spinball Mania. I love Sonic Spinball. <laughs> I don't think so. Doesn't sound like you. Oh, what is, what is that about? Some type oh, of blue science up. and and is, red science. You think the blue science would hurt you? I think they both they would both hurt me. Interesting. Probably yeah yeah. But you're made of blue. I am. Look at that ghosty ghosty rabbit. The original like uh, is this on the Switch? It is on the Switch. It is on. We are playing it on the Switch, but it is on all platforms. All platforms. You gotta hit the one over there. Oh. I think it does all of them. I don't know. You did it twice, you fool. I didn't want to. And yet... Huh. Uh, I'm playing chess with MJEC currently, and MJEC is like, being so aggressive! You definitely should get it. Real aggressive in the chess game. Aggressive. Just constantly aggressive. It didn't pay off in the last game, though. He got sneak checkmated. <laughs> Snook. Oh, yeah. Get, get. Barney. He's just up there barking. Oh, yeah, I like those busty. Oh, nice. The busty things? <laughs> those busty things. Speaking of, you said Facebook, right? No, I'm not. I don't think about our chess games. I'm just saying I was currently playing my, my moves. I'm about to make a move, but it takes me at least a couple days just to a, figure just, it out. Just a few days. I have a lot of things I do on the phone at night. Sometimes <laughs> I don't get to chess. I don't know, the last game we played, it said you had like three great moves, and I only had one. It, judges, like, it judges your moves? It, the chess app. It, it does that? Don't you ever look at the game review? No. Oh. Crazy. I try to live in the moment. I don't dwell on my mistakes. Yeah. This is the most false thing that has ever been said about me. <laughs> what you doing? I was just trying to get up. Just bouncing up there. Just trying to get I'm, up. I'm not trying to do it for just fun. Man, I'm just trying to get up. Ooh. A few brilliant moves. All right. Oh, yeah. Stardew Valley is great. Already have it. Yeah, I've got Stardew. I've, I've played it. It's fine. Ah, it fell. My I, hubris. 
Yeah, so Stardew, I, I just uh, couldn't get into it, and I know that people love it, and it's like their relaxation, yes. you know, tend their crops and stuff, and I think that's great for them. Um, mic noises, mic noises, mic noises. For me, it was like too much all at once. It was like, I was like thrown into this world, and I was like, oh man, I gotta get this farm up and running, because it's like my uncle's legacy or something. And then like... I did that a little bit, and then I was like, oh, I can go to town. I just I just didn't get into it. And I, I know I'm not a... That's not typical. I know people love it. And you like Animal Crossing, which I think is... Oh, it's like... Fuck oh, off. gee, wow. Yeah, Animal Crossing was fine. Also, I really liked that. You, but say, I, you say fine, but you played the hell out of that game. Well, I think it's just because I... Did it. You know, like I got it and I played. And then someone gave me Stardew, watch out, um, while I was playing Animal Crossing, and I started it, and I was like, well, this is like the same game, but I already know how to play that one. And so, I, yeah, I just couldn't couldn't get into it. I even started a farm with a friend, uh, and just completely betrayed them, like, just stopped, only played it once or twice. Oh, hell yeah, look at me go. I like those infinity legs. The story of, I was about to say, the story of why Sonic is blue, and it's, you know, it's canon within, you know, like, a comic book somewhere from, like, a long time ago in Japan is... You are doing those wrong. I'm, I'm doing it badly. Uh, is they gave him super... He was just a regular old hedgehog, and they gave him super fast shoes, and he moved so fast that he turned blue. <laughs> that's it. That's, that's all you uh, <laughs> Can't make this stuff up. I, so, War Sasquatch, I, did, I didn't mean to uh, shut you down or anything. If you, you know, you want to talk about Stardew, you can talk about Stardew, and that, that's totally fine. I was just saying, I, He's I, he does this to me all the time. <laughs> don't talk about that right <laughs> now. I don't like it. There's a lot I want to talk about on the stream, and he's like, we can't <laughs> talk about that today. <laughs> it's not true. It's not true. Damn it! Boom. You're always like, you're getting too political on stream. So political. Can't, can't wait for another election cycle. Hey, it's now. Yep. Can't can't wait to see. Where was I supposed to go? Bloody. We haven't played it on the stream, which we could. We have not played it on the stream. We could do like a joint farm on the stream. I could just bring my switch and look at projectors or whatever. But um, but there's Sanix to do. So many Sanix and Baldur's Gates. Yeah, there is Baldur. Baldur's Gate. Baldur. That's gonna blow up again. Oh, I know what I was supposed opposed to do. Mm -hmm. Those, those bouncy triangle things. Doop -a -doop -boop -boop. Um, seven six five two one three play is the number. <laughs> seven six five two one three play. Which should work. <laughs> you want to call in anybody? No. You can do it. Oh yeah. Wrong. Act three of Baldur's Gate is so overwhelming because you you I feel like Act one and two you're getting into your stride and you're like I get this game I'm doing great I'm beating some bad guys up and then Act three comes around and it's like oh there's so much to do in this city like you're just dumped into a city and it's like there's people everywhere I don't want to like oh fuck off hey the blue science hurts too. yeah it sure does so does the red science science in general hurts. I, I hear it's blinding. I've heard that she does that. She does the blinding, but she uses science to do it. Yeah, she's like, okay, we have to take three measurements and average them out. I can't see! You're doing great. I'm not doing great. You're doing. Look at you doing. <laughs> <laughs> I need a rang. Nice one. It's my life! <laughs> and it's now or never! <laughs> A lot of uh, John Bon Jovi fans in the chat. John Bon Jovi? <laughs> <laughs> I, um, I'm Jonathan Bonathan Jovi? I'm a big fan of his rosés. <laughs> his award. Sorry. I was. I'm so sorry. John Bon Jovi. His award winning. Rosés. Yeah, yes, I'm sorry. 
Which is true. You can go get it at any liquor store. He didn't make that. Yeah, he did. He bought it. Well, I mean, he owns the... He paid somebody. He's a vintner. A vintner. John Bond Vintner. <laughs> That's right. Him and his son. John Bond Jr. <laughs> John Bonds. Just get a bag of John Bonds. Jonathan Bonathan Jovi. A little Jovi. <laughs> little Bonathan. <laughs> little Bonathan. Oh, no, that's death down there. Is it? Just like real pinball. Is it? Yeah. Oh, how do you know? Because there's just a pit. But the pit might go somewhere. Yeah, death. I bet you have to go in the pit. Oh, I don't want to go in the pit. <laughs> Ooh, that's from Metropolis Zone. In Sonic 2. Just let it happen. Don't. There you go. Call back. Batter gate. It's a callback to Sonic's past. What the heck? You have those infinity legs. Yeah, I know. Going sweet. so fast. Is oh. that like a big spaceship in the background? You're trying it to blow it up? could be a big spaceship. Oh, jump! I did! Jump! Oh, no, a guy. Behold, a man. Oh! I don't. This, this level is, is for... It's crazy. It's hard. Jeez! Wow. Oh, wow. Ow. Oh, wow. Wow. Oh, wow. 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 Oh, we just wow. lost 80 followers. <laughs> They're like, no. No more. <laughs> oh. A boss. Boss monster. <laughs> um, I was watching some retro computer shit on YouTube. And there's a couple people who pronounce, how would you say the old operating system, D-O-S? DOS. They pronounce it DAWS. DAWS? It's very strange. Dawson's Creek? Yeah. I, you gotta get the hang of that. I can't get the hang of that. Well, that's too damn bad. <laughs> I love how they combine, like, all these old bosses. It's pretty cool. Yeah, really cool. Nice. Ah-ha! Ah-ha! You got ah one. Oh, wow. Dawes! Dawes boot. Wow, oh wow! <laughs> oh wow! Nice! You did it! You got the hang of it! I got, well, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Once. I just love uh, Dr. Robotnik's machines. They're just so. I can't beat this blue hedgehog! Eccentric. I must do a lot of science! And my machine must sort of match the landscape in which I'm to face him. I'll make a whole land on it. And he'll bounce around like crazy. <laughs> I need to get those chaos emeralds. I'm so evil. I need to get those chows. <laughs> no! You fool. Oh. Dang it, these green things are moving in a pattern. My weakness. Sonic is really bad at he just wants to go fast. No, that's not it. He just wants to Stop! No! I missed my opportunity! <laughs> and I got more green things to deal with. Green science. Can you hit him when... I'm gonna try. Like, like now. Oh. Did you see? So much. Get him. Ice frames! Yes. Use the eye frames! Use them to your advantage. Just like in real life. My eye frames! When you get hit and start blinking. Oh, oh my oh, no. goodness. Oh, oh, no. oh no. Oh no. Oh man, oh god! Oh but Jesus. Save me, Jeebus. Where are you? Go up to the other oh, one. Oh I have to get on both? This is too yeah. hard. I'm just a little guy. I can't do this. Just a little spiky guy. Get him. Oh, wow. there I go. There I go. oh no. <laughs> the eye, eye frames! frames. <laughs> Right, it's your time. All oh, those things are gonna come down. Whoa, whoa! I can't believe that didn't hit you. Me either. Your hitbox must be whoa. so tiny. Oh, oh, ah! Oh. 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 Narts. It's too hard. It's too hard. <laughs> I can't do it. I just can't do it, man. Oh, oh. nice. Effortless. Look at its the stance. Look at that squat. Squanch. It was a war sasquat. Sasquatch. Oh, look at that big M. Bison in the background. <laughs> oh, I, I got a... It's a big piggy. A, a big piggy. That's right, you did. You did all the work. 
You got it. I got him. The toilet. That's the toilet. Toilet. Uh, it's like an underwater level. I didn't even open my fake beer yet. God, underwater levels. My baby beer. Beer for babies. Sam Squatch. Sam Squatch. Oh, good. A water level. Love it. There was this old the whitest kids you know sketch that was uh, about baby beer. It was like we have this idea and it's beer for babies, and they're like you can't do that. And it became like the most successful product ever. <laughs> uh, it was like kid beer, and then it was baby beer, and it like they ended up making so much money that the universe like folded in on itself. <laughs> it was just too successful. Too successful. <laughs> beer for babies. Kid beer. Beer for kids. Okay, oh, well, alright. Oh, a little okay. a lion. Get wrecked. It's a lion. Uh, a new game came out today, which I definitely want to play, who I haven't had the opportunity to play yet. <coughs> Tekken 8 came out today. Tekken! And I have it, and it is loaded, and I've had no time to play it. Oh, nice. And I really want to. I really, really do. Probably can't hit the ones that are all electric -y. Exactly. Probably a good idea to not. Then that's none of them right now. What are Go in there. I'll go in there. Oh, I guess. Whatever. Oh, so nice. Catch the medals! I noticed that uh, none of our women friends are in the chat. That's right. What's going on? What is up? Well, I know that, uh... No, I don't know. <laughs> All right. Down. This is old school Sonic. Oh. oh, the Negazone. It double bounced me right in there. I got a medal. War Sasquatch, what does uh, your wife think about the stream? My wife! His wife is my cousin. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Oh yeah? Oh yeah. And ex next door neighbor. Ex next door neighbor. My wife! My wife! I want to talk to my wife! Get out of here, Fatso! <laughs> I want to talk to my wife! Just covered in chicken grease. <laughs> covered What's, in uh, chicken grease. What am I to use? Physics? Oh, is this a Half Life 2 all of a sudden? Here we go. It's a puzzle game! This is perfect background noise for grading papers. We, our voices, you don't have to listen. We're not saying anything important. That's true. Oh, that's okay. I just didn't know who was in the chat. You don't have to stop playing silly little phone games. And also, welcome to the stream. I love silly little phone games. I love going on my phone. <laughs> who doesn't love uh, the Doom rectangle in the evening hours? <laughs> I have a very perfect way to go to bed, which is... First you do your language lesson, then you do the Wordle, and then you do the mini. And then if you're not tired by then, you do Endless chess doom moves. scrolling? No, no, you do not doom scroll at night. That is a bad thing. Uh, Some light but cursing. Then, when you are tired, you go to bed, or the horrors hit your head, and you don't go to bed for hours. The horrors? Which is very common. Yeah, you just think about everything that has ever happened or will happen or didn't happen, and all of the her terrible things that'll happen, and then you have insomnia. That happens sometimes to me now, but it's usually, like, thinking of all the horrible things that could possibly happen to my kids. Yeah, no, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> like, that that's exactly. But then I don't fall asleep forever, and then I wake up because I was told that if you have those, you just get up because you're not going to bed. You shouldn't just sit down. Just go. Go. Just go somewhere else. Because the horrors. Get out of here, get out of here fat son. Yeah, just leave. I want to talk to my wife! Yeah, doom scrolling is a trap. It, it is a way to avoid that for a little bit. Like, that will take away the thought of the horrors for a little bit. Because then I just see the horrors. I don't the, have to the think. Horrors. I don't have to think. Well, they're there too. There's, which is good for them. Which is good for them. It's not. We don't use that word anymore. If they want to use. Uh, there's plenty of them that use that word. That's if that's fine. why they want to use that word, that's great. Um, yes. I did it! I did it! I'm so proud of you. I got medals. Sonic got medals. Yeah, exactly. It's just like all of the things that are currently happening or could happen or will happen. 
But what about thinking about things that did happen? And it's, I wish it was like, oh man, something positive could happen. Nah, it's uh, never that. Ooh, look at this squidly. Remember, if you worry about something, potentially you're suffering twice. Yeah, that's not really how it works, though. Because if you don't worry, at, at worst, you'll suffer once when it doesn't work out. But maybe you'll, you won't suffer at all when it, when it goes right. The best thing about having bad brain is My that rings. you can definitely logic yourself out of having it. Oh, yeah. I'll just... I'll just be smarter than my own What brain. is this goofy, many-armed thing? It's a, it's a little squid. And it's fire, fire and water bugs. Oh, yeah. Making the and he's water. Got, and he's got one, like, little electric penis. <laughs> I'm ready for you. It is. He's, it's a yeah. different one. He's got a little dangled penis. Oh! Ah! So much! <laughs> there was so much of it. Oh, why is why? Ah. Ah. Get him! Donk! Yeah, get out of here! I think he just like oh, it's a walrus! I think he was lifting up his arms like fuck you! <laughs> flipping some birds, flipping some birds and some birds. Exactly the things that did happen. Flipping birds and flipping birds. There's a lot of horrors going on in the world right now. And, uh, I don't like it. Ooh. Tim Neurotypical? Here's the thing. <laughs> it's my secret. <laughs> yeah, I think Tim Tim's a pretty... Pretty uh, Neurotypical. Yeah. Oh, I don't want to skip the story. Little... I know, he's just a little guy. Wait, is that me? No, it's just like a little side story going on. In Estecoromia? Is that the language you study on Duolingo? Yeah. But I only do one lesson a day, so Same. I'm still in like the, Same. this is a red dress. I would like a red dress, please. Oh, I'm what? I tested it. Please out. bring me the check. I, I didn't because I wasn't confident. Unprocessed right, it's got more votes. Uh, yes, and they won't release what they, oh, why are we aiming? But were we they a special aiming? Were they all the same writing? So that's the problem. Is like there was a mini campaign for people in New Hampshire to write it. There's a lot going on. Okay, there were people who were trying to like it was a purely write-in campaign. Biden was not running in the primary. The reason he wasn't running in the primary is because the Democratic Party switched the first primary to South Carolina. It used to be New Hampshire and Iowa. They got mad after 2020 because Iowa got so fucked up. If you remember, like Pete Buttigieg was like, I won, and he didn't win. <laughs> Bernie won. Yeah. And and like a bunch of their systems went down. Well, that happened to Bernie a lot all yeah, over the place. It sure did. Uh, so they did that. And so New Hampshire's like, we're still going to do a primary. And Biden's like, well, I'm not doing that. So the DCCC is, is not uh, recognizing it anyway. So people had a write-in campaign. Biden had his name written in, but some people were trying to do like a, a protest write in for ceasefire. Um, the problem is, is New Hampshire won't release what the write ins are. So it could be like Turd Fartley or ceasefire. So it's not like it would be nice to know what what the write ins were. Sure. Biden still won single person name. And, and it did, again, it doesn't matter. They're not counting anything. He got write ins. That's what happened. It didn't matter. But I would have liked to see what had happened with the protest right yeah, I mean, I, I'd, I'd vote for Turd Fergley. Turd. <laughs> I'd vote for Ceasefire, obviously. Ceasefire. What is this you speak of? Um, yeah, so that, that was where I last heard it. I, I, I don't think that they are going to release the number, like, what the write-ins were that weren't actual people and had a significant um, uh, percentage of the vote. There's a lot of fruit in this level. I like it. I'm sorry to interrupt. There, yeah, I kind of this this hammer business That's is cool. kind of yeah. it's kind of great. Exactly one. Yeah, one. You get a oh no, you get a double jump with the hammer. Yeah. Oh, so this is supposed to be like Sonic's girlfriend. Huh. This isn't Princess That's Sally exactly at all. That's exactly what I was gonna say. It's not Princess Sally or a human woman. <laughs> There's a couple games where it's and like a story where it's it's a human woman. So weird. Remember that movie where uh, Jerry Seinfeld was like, "Hey, I'm gonna be a bee." Yeah, he's and, a bee movie. And I'm gonna try to bang this lady, and she's gonna be into it, uh, even though she's a human woman and I'm a bee. She's gonna like flirt with me because I'm 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 a bee. Yeah. 
It was like when Jerry Seinfeld dated a 17 year old. And everyone's like, what's that movie gonna be called? It's like, B movie. Do you get it? It's a play on words. Do you get it? Because it's a movie about a bee and it's not very good. <laughs> <laughs> but you can download the whole script and send it to a C, like a, uh, like a food order and have it print out <laughs> on a receipt like the entire script of B movie. <laughs> if you wanna piss off an establishment. <laughs> What's the deal with B-Movie? <laughs> That's how we test a lot of uh, our software to see if like it can I think you messed up. No, I got it. Oh, you're pushing both? You're yeah. so strong. Yeah, maybe. Um, she's like uh, Miss Piggy, like, hi-ya! <laughs> I think you gotta push that other one, too. Yep. Oh, oh, yeah, definitely. You don't wanna go in there. But yeah, we test our software to see if like the text box is how much it can handle. So we'll put the entire script of B-Movie in there. <laughs> Wordplay is your favorite play. I think my favorite play is Death of a Salesman. Biff. You get it? Yeah, Biff. Biff. Bar. Bar. That's so funny when Barney does that. Bar. He just does these little barks. Just... Bar. 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 Barney. Wow, rings. After Scrooge. I also really like uh, Wordplay. Well, how do I make this thing go down? I don't. I gotta push something on top of it, probably. Oh, is there a thing to push? I don't know. Oh, oh yo, he's so look sad. at that little guy. Oh, oh, oh. She's like, don't worry. And he's like, but I'm a robot and producing tears. Don't question. I would never question. Donk. Oh, I, I can't oh now you're heavy enough. Oh, can I go back? Boing. 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 Oh, you did it twice. That's nice. You can go back and save your progress, like, doubly. I got the big coin. You did it. I bet it's going to do it again, too. It's the last time you touched it. Some fruit up there. Yeah, I don't know about it. Who's that big fruit shooter? Hey there, big shoots. Big shoots. I haven't even watched last season yet. I haven't even watched a couple seasons. A couple, th couple two, three. The last season just got released this year. Yeah, that's what he said. I haven't seen it yet. Uh, I haven't seen a lot of things. Those wacky Nadians. Oh! Uh -huh. You got smushed. You got smushed by the giant fruit. You better don't uh, go too I far. I have to go like at the, appro the appropriate yes. speed. Golly! It's like in an escort mission in a video game where the person is faster than your walking speed but slower than your running the speed. The thing that everybody loves in video games. Escort, escort missions. missions. We we also loved it during half that Half-Life game. Ugh. I feel like that made us give up on that game. It was also really hard. So hard. Um, it was really good. I yeah, would like to good. finish it sometime. Um, oh no, I don't like that one bit. Well, that was me, I think. Yeah. <laughs> like chalk on a nails board. Nails board. Oh, damn. You know what? I uh, finished again and then started playing. Chess. No, I'm never going to finish chess. <laughs> um, Alan Wake. Oh, I love Alan I Wake. I finished Alan Wake again. It has been since it released that I played it again. Really good. Really so good. Just finished. Uh, then I started playing... Alan Wake 2, which just came out. That came out. So have you played Alan Wake's American Nightmare? No, not yet. It's pretty good. Um, but I haven't. I'm very interested in Alan Wake 2. Alan Wake 2, it, I just started it. Uh, I'm probably just about an hour into it. One, it has Sam Lake as a character in it. He doesn't play Sam Lake, but he's like, it's his body. Sam Lake is the guy who wrote Alan Wake. He works for Remedy. Oh. But you might know him more... Uh, as the face of uh, Max Payne, the guy with like the squinty face, that's Sam Lake. Uh, I don't know. Uh, have you ever played Max Payne? No. It's Remedy's like big first game. Uh, okay. Anyway, Sam Lake is is like an FBI agent in it, but you play Saga so far. I think you, it, it's two characters. You play Alan Wake and Saga, which is a FBI agent investigating a murder. The biggest thing I'm not gonna give anything away. Um, the biggest thing that I had noticed is I played. Alan Wake on the three, oh. I played the 360 version, um, Xbox 360, and then I played that on the Xbox Series X, 
And do you know how many graphics they installed in that? A oh lot. my god, it looks incredible. I was just like, this game has so many graphics. They just turned the, the knob all the way up. Like every graphic. I don't know why more companies don't just turn that knob all the way up. Oh man, it looks so good. Oh no! Yeah, that's a that's a haunting noise. Yeah. Whoa. Another one of my cousins is on the Switch playing right now, which is where, Sp where Sasquatch's wife's sister. That's who is on there. So so many. It's very familial. Yes. Oh! Get I it? Got, get the Quaos Emerald. I got, I got turboed. Anyway, Alan Wake 2 is so good. I want. Uh, that's all I want to do is play Alan Wake 2. Uh, I've heard good things, um, and I would love to play it because I love it. Oh my god. That is, um, I actually don't think your computer can handle it. Probably not. My computer... That's like the one game that you, that has come out where I'm like, I don't know if Tim's computer is actually going to be able to play it. And it is not on any system, you know. It doesn't, it doesn't work on the PS2. <laughs> I'll show you. I remember when your son was like, can we play Fortnite? He's like, no. But there's a PS2 in there. <laughs> yeah. Like, well, it doesn't work on the PS2. <laughs> um, I don't know if you're going to get this chaos involved. Almost! It's hard. It is. Oh, you're so close! Damn. Oh. It's running away from me. Yeah, I... Man, the graphics. I just can't get over it. It looks so good. And the story's good. It's very, like, a, if you don't... If you like, like, a supernatural, like, thriller or horror, um, kind of very Twin Peaks-esque. Listen, I don't think the graphics have improved since... Mario 64. I have said the story on the stream yeah, before, I but uh, I, there is definitely like multiple times where you look back and they look terrible, but I'm like, Man, graphics, this just doesn't get better than this. It can't improve. This is, is as real as, it, this is what Mario would look like in real life. <laughs> like a piece of paper. Yeah, he would look like this. I also, okay, two things. One, I actually have a recorded, uh, a recorded record that's redundant. I, yeah, okay. Everyone just calm down. Um, you're not gonna get the halfway I point? I just wanna keep floating. Oh, no, never mind that. Uh, one, when everybody complained about the Zelda that came out on GameCube, Wind Waker, not Twilight Princess, and they're like, oh, it's for kitties, it looks bad. I said, this art style slaps, and it does. It holds up so good to this day. Wind Waker looks amazing. Day. They were like, oh, it's Zelda, because it was cell shaded. No, it looked awesome. One, I was right. I have correct opinions. Two, <laughs> when the Wii, which was called Project Revolution up to that point, when they released the name for Wii, I have a blog entry saying, I think this name is a good idea. I think it's good, and I think it's going to catch on. And I was right, and everyone who was uh, down on it was incorrect. Is all this thing, I'm settling scores, everybody! Feels like you've based a Come large on. amount of your personality on the fact that you like the name The Wii. Um, why, why did, why, why did? I just think that there's a lot of reactionary Oh, at, there's the little robot. Look, there he is. I, uh, there's Nintendo World in Orlando. Um, at Universal Studios, which I'd like to go to, which I believe would definitely fit a man of your stature. He's he's very tall. He's very, very tall. And War Sasquatch, truthfully, um, most things in Japan, if you look at me, I'm 5'11", pretty average height and weight for an American male. Oh, no. Things are too small for me there. They just don't accommodate people of our stock. I remember most of the shoes. I, I don't even have a big foot. I have a size nine shoe, and uh, most of the shoes didn't fit. Shoes. Shoes. Oh no! Get that. Nice. Oh. Uh oh man. Raw, raw, raggy. 
yeah, that that is gonna be an issue. But I'm saying like the cutoff is, is far lower than like you. Like it's just there's just not very big people in Japan. Not nobody, just the average size person in Japan is pretty small. And it could have. I mean, I I went. Ooh. In 2005, almost 12, 20 years ago? Damn! I don't want to think about that. Anyway, uh, it very well could have, you know, things have been westernized and globalized in that time, so things could have changed. Oh, he's so mad! He's got those big red rockets! Oh! Dr. Robotnik's big red rocket. <laughs> I think I've been on the internet long enough to know that that almost surely exists. Sonic, oh! oh. <laughs> Sonic uh, fandom is some of the horniest fandom that exists out there. Well, uh, oh, uh. Come on, send it to something. Go. I like that mechanic. That's cool. It's pretty cool. These bosses are pretty original. Like, I like they've it. done a good job of uh, coming up with very fun, fun times. So, did you hear that thing about the news? About how we can now hire like ten months old to do forty hours a week? I mean, time to get those kids back to work. Child labor's back, baby! Oh yeah, here in Florida, they're like, we have an employment crisis because people don't want to work for shit wages. And you but know you know who does want to work? 10 month old? Yeah, well not 10, like I was being facetious, but like uh, young kids as early as 12, 13, um, can work a full time job, which is just cool. It's because their hands are small and they can fit into those, those machines. Good for thieving. Yeah, good for thieving and, and good for, like, hard labor. That's okay. Profits are up, productivity's up, but wages... Stagnant. I should have been a capitalist. Thank you. No, we all are, sadly. Not by choice, but by force. But, like, a main one. Oh, the one with all the capital? Yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that should... I should have been born into wealth. Damn it! I, it was a really big mistake on my part. I, I was re I think it was posted uh, today. It was like a Business Insider article or something, and it was like how to make a successful company. It was like start a company, make money. <laughs> oh, jeez! Oh, oh, damn! That was it. That's all I had to do the whole oh, time. I am. I am not good at this. What was I thinking? Not doing that. Health insurance should be, it's a luxury, okay? It's true, yeah. I mean, you don't need it. You don't need it. Oh, no. oh I didn't get the pain. Oh, maybe? Oh, oh I got oh, it! Just yeah, barely. big old penguin man. The thing about having health insurance is it's vastly overrated. If you never go to the doctor, you never have anything wrong what with you. What are you using it for? Nothing. I like how people's arguments against like single payer like government own is like, I don't want to pay for someone else's uh, whatever, and it's like that's what insurance is, you moron. That is exactly you, the pool is just smaller, so you have to pay more. Doing it anyway. Yes, but I I have invented a guy in my head who is so against everything I stand for that the thought of this this man that doesn't exist having health insurance while I also do just take makes advantage me so mad of of a poor american yeah. like me I work hard and by work hard I have an inflated sense of self in what I actually do which is fuck off on the toilet 9 hours a day Listen I traded 18 beans for this house Yes. In 1957, why can't you just get some beans like I did? Uh, I, I just want to keep my shitty insurance because what happens if I... I know Ron at the insurance. Exactly. 
He gave me this rate that I have not checked up on, but he gave me a firm handshake. And uh, a bunch of big actors in both parties are telling me you don't want you don't want the stupid government insurance that everybody who's on Medicare and Medi uh, not Medicaid but Medicare. I don't need government insurance. I have Medicaid. Heard that in real life before. <laughs> I've heard that said in real life. Heard. What do we need Social Security anyway for? Says the retired person on Social lots, Security. Lots of libertarians who have a lot of government uh, uh, largesse handed to them. A uh, lot of people in unions who are sad That money's just sitting there. A lot of people have been protected by good uh, union jobs who have told me that they don't need anything. And it's like, oh, my goodness. Oh, you have been so misguided. For real, it's crazy. Um, very uh, fucked. I think you'll have I to fight this big snake. I'm going to fight this snake. I'm going to fight this snake. I'm going to be friends with snake. That's a lucky hit. Uh, get that. You missed it, probably. Exactly. If you don't have teeth, what are you doing going to the dentist? Uh, I heard that our founding father, if you need anything, uh, he had wooden teeth. So why don't you go to the garage and build some? That's right. They were wood and nothing else. I don't want to talk about it. Because Papa America would never have done anything bad ever in his life. Wooden teeth are the way to go. They were made from wood. That's it. There's no other choice. Nothing else. Definitely not other teeth. No. Couldn't be other teeth. Yes, wooden ones that were made... In America. You know that time he chopped down that cherry tree and then he made teeth out of it? And then he l did not lie about it because he's Papa America. He said, I'm making teeth. <laughs> what are you doing out here, son? I'm making he, teeth, daddy. He, he, he chopped down the cherry tree and he said, someday I'm going to be president of America. And his dad said, what the fuck is America? Fun, <laughs> <laughs> uh, fun. Uh, oh, it's a it's a portal. I don't know, but I'm going in it. What was that? Why was it there? Oh, 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 oh! <laughs> oh. oh. <laughs> oh it's just a few rings. That's all. Skeletons in the basement. I have not. Speaking of skeletons in the basement, I'm. I have not felt comfortable bringing Glenn down here yet because I have not fully fin furnished the basement. It feels pretty furnished. It's close, but it's not done. I mean, it, it feels more furnished than your last basement. Oh yeah, but I mean, like, get Glenn down there. You can't just have Glenn in the basement. I'm gonna have Glenn in the basement. Okay? The mere fact that you call it that tells me you're not ready. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh no! I just I love video games because there's always like the level archetypes. There's gotta be a water level and a desert level and a lush green level. It's where you start. You start in the green level. That's well, because you're traveling through Earth. That's right. Maybe you'll even get a space level where it's not on Earth anymore. Sometimes there's a city level. Oh, there it is. Oh, there's a snack. It's real cartoony. Oh, Way no. more cartoony than I thought. Uh, it there was, was a portal that opened up. I think I'm gonna have to look this lightning. Thing. Maybe the snake will be your friend. Oh, he's coming for you. Dr. Bob Robotnik. Oh, man. How was that in the ground? Oh, that's not a snake. No, it's... Oh! Platforms! I don't want to get hit by this. Oh. Robot! Oh, that's how you're gonna get him. No, you just oh. get one. Just get Come one. Come on. Yeah, like Sonic One, you can just go boom, boom. boom yeah, boom, that's what boom. I want to do. Uh, it'd be nice of him to replace the ground. It was nice of him. This is a snack. Um, Oh, I wonder where he's gonna put there. We got him. Ah, uh, just the one. Just the one. Even though I hit him twice, he's got those eye he's frames. He's got the eye frames <laughs> as well. Oh. Bonk, bonk. Jumps right through it. <gasps> oh, this one. I wonder what happens if you go in there. Oh, bad things. Thank you, Phil. 
vicious. But I don't want to be a man. Get him! I'm just watching you. Also, welcome to the stream, Veracity Jane. Veracity Jane is here. I thought it was a penguin, but I guess it's a little more. Yeah, I'm just saying blue words. It's Hans Molman. Hans Molman. How many hits do you take? Back in the day, it was 10. That's too many. Back in my day. Oh, he's not shooting any more buttons. Last one. Oh, he just flew in the air that time. I don't have any Wow, here they come, here they come, here they come. Oh, he's just refilling them all. His last gasp. Oh, there's so many enemies coming. You can, I feel like I can always tell uh, a Nintendo boy because they always want to jump on every enemy's head. Yeah, obviously. Time. And you can just spin dash through them. Yeah, but I not, that's not Mario. Mario would never. Exactly. Mario would never. He would never spin dash. Mario can't spin dash. He's a plumbus. <laughs> How are you supposed to get him? And I feel like they made some of the enemies like purposefully dangerous. How, how do I get? Do I have to get him when he's like think, on the way up? Maybe. Man, that's lame. Just let me beat Bud Robotnik. This is annoying. You just gotta get good. No, that's not it. Do I have to get him on the way out? Like hit him on the side? Like hit him on his butt. Oh, cool. I know, that's what I'm saying. I, I don't know what to do. Get him inside. How, like, how? Yeah. What? Now you're thinking like a Sega man. I literally don't know what to do. How are you supposed to hit him? You're supposed to sink down into the sand. I don't know what to do. Do you think like the those digger ones will hurt him when he goes through the... I don't know. Like the ones that are digging down? The blue ones? I mean, maybe. I don't I don't know why an enemy... His enemy would hit him. You said they're digging. Well, yeah, leave the blue ones alive. Or any of them. I think he just popped it. Don't kill the... Don't kill the blue ones next time. Okay. Let's see what happens. You had a hedgehog when I was a kid. It smelled bad. <laughs> you had a hedgehog? Yeah. Was it blue? No. Just a regular chog? Yep. Yeah, at least it feel like they're like digging. Oh. I think they just destroyed. They just bust through, yeah. What the heck? I, I, I don't know what you're supposed to do. Can you look up what the hell I'm supposed to do? What's this game called? Sonic Superstars.
platforms. Yeah. Sand creatures. Uh, jump underneath the blue mole as it pops out of the sand, causing you to hit it midair, sending it back toward robotic and doing substantial damage. How would how would one know that? Right, because you didn't have to do it. Those, yeah, I gotta hit those on the, when they first fly when they out. First fly out. Okay. The other ones are sharp, pointing down. So they'll just hurt. What a what a wild boss. That's what they said about Michael Scott. They did. That's my boss. Yeah. Okay. I guess that's how we're going to do it. Again, I don't know from whatever context you would possibly right. figure that out. Just on accident somehow? Yeah, it would have to be on accident. There's no indicators that say, like, that's what you're supposed to do. Got right, him. We have time for one more? I think one more. Uno more. Not today. Uh, I didn't get the, the plum. No big guy. Sonic got through Act 1. Got through it. Survived. Survived. It's going. I'm here. Donk. Oh, why did you smash through that like that? Loading. Press, press factory. factory. This is where press is made. Oh. Hot off the presses. Yeah, Sonic, we all gotta go work at the dick sucking factory. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's just like a, a standard term for like going to work at the, the shitty job you have. Is it? The old, yes, at least online. The old dick sucking factory. Listen, lady. Oh, yo, oh, what? Something's making me bounce. Well, I think when they hit, like, dum, 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 like, yeah. it pushes. Everything. Yep. No, it's in the background. You can see it pressed down. The press. Oh, yeah. Oh, we got a big one now, boys. I think you got to get to the green. The green side. Nice. Uh... Oh, my God. It's startling. What on earth do you <clears throat> think that the Robotnik branded? <laughs> what what's he selling? Like, yeah. you, got what no, are the... you got no ring. I know. I figured there'd be some. There was nothing. I know. Not a ring in sight. What are the people buying from Robotnik? Like, what's it? What's How it does he get all the capital like to do all this? He's a mad scientist. Yeah, I know. But like, who's in the mad scientist game? Like, surely they want something back for their investment. Like, he's taking a lot of resources. I know he's, like, enslaving the animals to get them to work. Like, do machinery? Yeah. Also, like, he's making them into robots, but they're just, like, in a shell of a robot. They're just flying around. They're not doing any work. Why they're don't not... you just use computers? They're not doing any jobs. Robotnik, I have a lot to say about this game about a very fast blue hedgehog. About the realism of your factory. I think he's just, like doing it for the sake of it. He's like, I like building crazy machines and crazy factories and I like it and and so what if it doesn't do anything real? And impressively, his shit works. Now, it doesn't kill a hedgehog. What is it? It works, but it doesn't do anything. It doesn't do any... Like, he he has very elaborate hedgehog killing machines that don't actually kill Oh my god. Hedgehogs. As a shareholder in Evil Corp, I would like at least one hedgehog killed by these hedgehog killing things. The thing is, oh, what? you really are attracted to the spikes. Uh, I think I was hitting those jumps at just the wrong times with the hedgehog. 
I don't think that most hedgehogs would survive these machines, to be fair. It's true. Just the one that you're trying to get the most is. Yeah. And, like, to Robotnik's credit, how could he have known? The super fast hedgehog. That this is the hedgehog that was going to come after his stuff. He's like, he had one guy who said, chili dogs. And he's like, no, my dreams. <laughs> oh. Boing. Oh, okay. Oh, my God. It's like Sonic the Hedgehog and John Cougar Mellencamp, who are really into chili dogs. Just sucking them down. Sucking on a chili sucking dog. Sucking on them. What a way to describe eating a chili dog. Well, how do you eat a chili dog? I suck on them. I, it's like a choking hazard. You don't want to suck on a chili dog. You want to chew it fully and then swallow. Okay, so I do like the aspect of this where I have to like get to a spot where it won't bounce me up into a spot I don't want to be in. Yeah, it's, it's a challenge. Shalom. Kind of cool. It's like a physics puzzle. It is. That's one thing that you haven't seen a lot of uh, since the cartoon. Is like, why don't they embrace Sonic's love of the chili dog? Right. Oh. So many pigeons. So many robot pigeons. Urkel should be telling us about the chili dogs and after school lessons. So he's like, I need robot animals to work in my factory. I'm gonna fill them with real animals. Why not just put the real animals to work? I agree. Give them the jobs. Give me the rock. Cause they're alive in there. There's like something's feeding them. Yeah, they're alive in there. Like, uh, that's what I don't understand is like, are they using their animal prowess to do it? No, just use a computer. They seem safe and well fed. Well rested, they hop right out. Oh, Robotnik, we have so much to teach you about how to kill this hedgehog. I mean, I've killed this hedgehog so many times over the years. <laughs> exactly. Why do you keep putting ri rings in your elaborate factories? Yeah, just, just don't put any rings in there. <laughs> it's his life force. I think those were dropped there by the resistance. If only that existed in this world. We, Why doesn't it? I agree. Why get that? Why has no one made a game that was about the? Why don't we have like, a Sat Am? Yes. Sonic game. That's the game that the people want. By the way, Sat Am is Saturday, Saturday, morning. Saturday morning cartoon, where it was a dystopia and there was Princess Sally, who was totally Donald Duck in it. Oh yeah, no pants. No pants, just vest. Chipmunks don't wear pants. Is she a chipmunk? What was she? I don't know. Hmm. She was a woodland animal. Yes, they all were. They was like a team. One of them had a robot arm. The skunk had a really cool bolt shooter on his wrist. It, they were great. It was like the resistance fighters of yeah. like woodland animals. It was a super awesome show. The fact that we don't have a Sonic game based on that story is a crim. A crim. A crime. <laughs> Are you a crime? An all, criminal? A criminal? A criminal? Wow. Oh, wow. Oh, no. Oh, no, not that. Oh, no. No. There was so much of it. Apparently, Marty <laughs> woke up. <laughs> All right, let's bring it home. He used to not bark. Oh, so it's exploding. Look. Oh, Ever since we moved houses, he's, he's been a lot more barky. All right. We got some kind of a orangutan. Orange Utang. Okay, this is a very similar boss to the finale of Sonic 1, yep. except Robotnik was in those tubes. And now he's got a robot monkey. With a zapper butt. <laughs> he's gonna zap you. No! Oh, it's so many rings. Now get him. Only once, though. Just the one. He has that button there. Why is he? I like the realistic pistons. You got those pistons in the background. <laughs> of a combustion engine that is cutaways of a of an engine. Doing a lot of mechanical science. 
Ah, Donkey Kong here. Won't leave me alone. Donkey. Oh. Looks with his dang, eyes. Dang, eyes. Dang. No! I got so scared. You were close to that. Oh no! It sounds like he's eventually gonna hit that red button. Like, he keeps swinging more and more. Yeah. Harder. Oh, that was oh, different. Oh, what? This is, uh... Man, you did pretty good there for a while. Now you can get him. Oh, oh okay. Oh, jeez. Way to not follow a recognizable pattern, my man. Oh. I think that if you had um, all the pistons come down, it'd probably kill them. Yeah, you just do all of them. Yeah, you should just... That would kill the hedgehog. Yeah, that yeah, would really kill that chog. Get him, early on. He's gonna come up and have his electric hat. Oh, oh a big old chicken. It was a chicken inside the monkey? <laughs> <laughs> what a country. It seems like you'd put a monkey inside a monkey, but what do I know about animal-based robotics? <laughs> Nothing is what... You ever built a robot to house an animal? I built a robot, but not to house an animal. To feed and house an animal and also do work for you? I've, I've done one Jeez, of like, those things. How expensive does just one of those botnicks have to be? A botnick? Badnick. Badnick. <sighs> this whole factory, this whole big press. What uh, was he pressing so hard? He never, his emotions, he's trying to push him down. Cause Squish him down. This, this, this hedgehog keeps getting to him. It's hard out here. For it's hard out here. Oh, Metal Amy, pink. We could be Metal Amy. Not today. Not tonight, we can't. I bet you there's only eight worlds, because there's usually only eight worlds. I like how there's this map where you can go to any of them. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Can you see what the next one looks like? I think oh. it looks like the old Sonic. Ooh. Well, everyone. Thank you for joining us. Yes, thank you so much. Super fun. Who Radiant Silver Gun. Such a good game. Such a good game. Um, we are uh, going to probably finish this game next time. <laughs> yeah, on the next time. We'll see ya. Bye. <laughs> next time. On the next time. Bye. Fart. <laughs> <laughs>